Hi, sweeties. Let's take a moment to appreciate this lipstick. Ooh. Today I'm gonna do another Q&A video, but this time I'm gonna answer questions from Instagram and Facebook. But before we start with the questions, don't forget to subscribe because I post videos three times a week and you can be part of this family. Also give the video a thumbs up because it really helps the channel. Have you ever been to America? No, just South America. <laughs> What do your parents and friends think about the way you dress? I think they like it, usually they say good things about it. Unless they're lying. <laughs> do you support Trump or Hillary more? I know you're not American, but come on, everyone is interested in that topic. <laughs> well, I'm a huge Trump supporter. <laughs> Just joking. I mean, I don't want to say too much because I don't live in America, so I don't actually know what's going on. But I find it really hard to believe that someone like Trump that said sexist things, homophobic things, racist things is someone suitable to be president of the United States. I'm sorry, I know he won and a lot of people voted for him, but hell no, <laughs> I'm still a Hillary supporter. Favorite bands? Evanescence, Nightwish, Black Sabbath, Metallica, Iron Maiden. What's your favorite song? I've got two. One is Dreamer by Ozzy Osbourne and the other one is Pretty Little Psycho by Porcelain Black. Who's your favorite Sanrio character? Rila Kuma. Would you ever come to Australia? Yes, for sure. I would love to. Actually, yesterday I was watching a documentary about that train in Australia. It's called The Gan. Really cool. What got you into YouTube? I just wanted to make more friends that like the same things as me, like alternative fashion, colorful hair and eventually start doing some music stuff as well, but I still haven't done it. <laughs> Out of all of the videos you have made on your channel, which five have been your favorite to do? I don't know, I think all the daily vlogs and like travel vlogs, because I don't film them that often because sometimes real life is just boring but when something actually happens and i travel and get to film a daily vlog i really enjoy it and i wish i could film more vlogs how many languages do you speak and what languages would you like to learn i speak portuguese and english more or less <laughs> i would love to learn german because part of my family is german and i'm the only one that doesn't speak german black sheep of the family how long have you been with your girlfriend well for about a year and a half. Wow! If it reaches two years, it's gonna be like the longest relationship I've ever been in. Scary! <laughs> when do we get to see your girlfriend? <laughs> the thing is, she's more or less in the closet and she's very private. She doesn't like appearing on social media and stuff. So that's why I don't talk about her so much here. Because I don't want everybody to get super excited like, oh my god, I want to see your girlfriend and she's not gonna appear <laughs> maybe she's kind of worried because she's a lot older than me but i'm telling her that you guys are so nice nobody's gonna mind that she's older than me you're so open-minded and stuff isn't it like right there in the comments so i can show her so we can convince her <laughs> what's your ultimate advice for someone who's struggling with work slash school stress by the way you are so amazing your eyeliner is so beautiful well thank you <laughs> I think if something is bothering you too much, you should just change it. So if you really don't like your job and it's so stressful, you should look for another job. I know with school sometimes it's harder because you depend on your parents to change schools, but try to if it's really bad for you. What's been the best thing about 2016? For me, it was seeing the channel grow and starting university. I went to get my whole hair dyed. How do I convince my parents to dye my hair? If you're like at school age, get good grades and be like a good girl or boy and then say to them that you won't change and you'll be exactly the same person if you dye your hair and you won't stop being responsible just because of a hair color. Do you like Melanie Martinez? Oh my god, yes, I just featured her so much on my previous video about the top 10 creepy cute songs. I'm a guy and love all the different styles you wear, but I'm afraid of being judged for enjoying it. Any tips for guys slash people in general on how to be comfortable expressing themselves in the alternative fashion scene? I understand that sometimes it's a bit hard when you go out and people are staring at you and stuff, you feel a bit self-conscious, but you need to kind of train yourself not to care about that anymore and trust me it's possible because the first time I dyed my hair pink I went out I had the feeling everybody was looking at me and I was super conscious and like <laughs> but I learned not to care anymore and now I don't even remember I have colorful hair I'm so used to it and the way I dress as well so go for it and it doesn't matter that you're a guy as well that's so cool when guys are alternative as well fashion is for everybody it doesn't matter your gender your color your age your nationality just go for it. 
How long have you been wearing makeup? I'm 14, is it okay for me to wear a full mask of makeup every day to school? I think I started wearing makeup when I was 12 <laughs> But I started slowly, like just eyeliner It took me years to actually wear like full makeup I think it's okay once in a while But don't wear foundation and stuff every day because it's quite bad for your skin I don't even wear makeup every day to be honest, I wear makeup to film videos <laughs> If I'm just going to work and stuff I'm like pfft. If you were part of Harry Potter, who would you like to be and why? Oh, Hermione. I know it's a boring thing to say, but she's just my favorite. <laughs> That's it for today, my lovelies. I'm sorry if I didn't answer everything because I didn't want the video to be too long. Thank you so much for watching. Have a very, very lovely day. Mwah.